we are trying our Mr. Incredible is joining us today. Um, chocolate cake. Chocolate and cheese. vanilla cheesecake from Gluten Bakery in Squirrel Hill. Also these. Also these. Show them. Go ahead. Show them what we got. So we have, they had two bagels today. And I think this is like an herb and cheddar bagel. And this is a plain bagel. The top is the most giant one. The top is the most giant one, in case you didn't know, in case you can't see because of the video. Um, but so let's start with the this bagel. Yeah, I so love that take bagel. Bites. Let's take bites of this cheddar. Let's each have one. Let's get Abby one. Abby's in here with us because there's food involved. We're going to try it all at once. And we're going to get it either a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Mmm. Mm. Abby, what do you think? That's good. Mmm. I think that was a pretty good one. I gave so here's it a, what it looks like. I gave it a thumbs down. He gave it a thumbs He's picky, though. But it's really good and flaky. And you can really kind of see the cheddar in there. Sit down. And um, yeah, it just looks really, really good. I love it. That's I good. You, I okay. recommend that one. Okay, now this is a small bagel. They make a big plain bagel. So let's try that one. Okay. All right, so now we're gonna try this one. We'll give Abby a piece. Preston a piece. I, I don't want any. Well, you don't want it. He already had some of this, actually. It didn't, none of these made it all the way home. Because so let's try I it. I gave it a thumbs down. That means I get none of it. Hmm. Like it means it gets none of it. Yep. But Because I hate go fast. So, Abby, what do you think of that one? Good. good. It's very actually, I gave... It's it's good. It's um. I gave it a thumbs down and a thumbs up. He gave it a thumbs down and a thumbs up. So he's kind of like this. The plain bagels are really good, but I think they're What's the they're salty juice? and buttery. So if you're into I that, these are perfect. Okay, now we're gonna get to the good stuff. To the cheesecake. Okay, which one are we trying first? Okay, we're gonna try the. Vanilla cheesecake first. So here's what it looks like. Package. Yeah. Good stuff. All right. Are you going to try some? You, you use your fork. A light. Yep. You try yours. You set that down. There you go. That's Abby's fork. Mine. Go ahead. You can try it if you want. I gave this one a thumbs up. A thumbs up. <laughs> That's good. Plus, I'm going to keep eating it. He's going to keep eating it. See, we got to save room because we're going to try some of the chocolate. Oh, on the floor. Now the dog's going to try some of it, too. Mm -hmm. There we go. Is it on the floor? Did it go on the floor? Or just on the chair? Just chair food. We're going to, we're still going to sacrifice that one. It'll be good. Okay. I think it's the, the vanilla cheesecake from Gluten Bakery in Squirrel Hill near Pittsburgh is Preston approved. Yeah? Is it Preston approved? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. All right, let's try the chocolate cheesecake now. Monsters Incorporated. Monsters Incorporated. I don't know if that's his rating, the Monsters okay. Incorporated rating, but okay. Let's try the next now one. we're gonna try the chocolate cheesecake. My favorite. Yeah, somebody might end up throwing up at the end of this, but that'll just mean it's a good, and, and there it is in his mouth. I don't know if they want to see that, but I'm glad you showed them just in case they did. Good. <laughs> All right. Now let's try the, Abby's already anticipating the chocolate cheesecake. All right, take a small bite, maybe That's, a small bite. It's <laughs> for a big bug one. Okay, what do you think, Ab? Go ahead and try it. I did. Oh, you did? It's, it's, um, it's good. There's a lot of chocolate. A lot of chocolate. I give this one a thumbs up gooder. It's a gooder. It's a thumbs up gooder. That means it's probably on a, on a rating scale yeah, of like... I, I gave them all of the thumbs up. All of the thumbs up. On a rating scale of like 1 to 10, with 10 being really, really super great best you've ever had, what number would you give it from 1 to 10? Uh, 
100. 100. There you go. You gotta gotta try it. Can I have a bite? Can okay, I try I'll it? Give it a night. Mm. Mm. There's seven up like that. I don't know what it is. It's pretty good. I'll give it give Unicorn. It. Yeah. I'd say I give it about an eight. Yeah. It's very I give it I give it one hundred and eight. He gives it 108, so that's pretty good. I think I like the vanilla one more. You know, like the vanilla one better? I like this one and this one. Mm -hmm. I like both of them. So it was going to be nap time, but now I don't think it's going to be nap time for quite a while. We might just skip that today. Thanks for gluten, gluten me. Um, but yeah, the reason I wanted to make this video too is because last you night we went, hi, went to... Yeah. Um, we went to Caddyshack, and that's a local fun place near us. And we went out to eat dinner afterwards. And the restaurant that we went to was, um, I won't name the, name the restaurant, but it was difficult for Abby to pick foods for her to have for dinner. So we wanted to go to um, a, a bakery today and find some foods that might make it a little bit easier for her to cope with the change of being gluten free. The never cracker place. Yeah, what he said. So, um, so yeah, it, we just need to keep looking for places like Gluten Me, and we talked about I'm Herbalicious. Now? I would hope so. So, um, so yeah, let us know what your favorite places are, and if you're looking for gluten-free, dairy-free options, there's My also place is Big Lots and Eating Park. Big Lots and Eating Park. Eating Park has gluten-free buns too. So, thank you for that tip. Um, but find me gluten free is also an app that you can use that will help you um, find local gluten free options for yourself. So, yeah. Anything you want to add, Ab? No. No. Okay. All right. Take care.